Hi to be tours! Our adventurous animators starts now! During the following weeks we will be doing small animation and illustration exercises to develop our skills in the digital arts and our challenges will be easy and small so that our process will be fun and enjoyable. The first thing that we will learn is how to download and install the TubeTube software on our computer. All the exercises that we will do will be using the app. And everything will be free, so no need to worry. To install the app, we gotta go to the TubeTube website. Once we're in there, we have to click on the Downloads button. Then we have to click on Download TubeTube Desk. You have to select your computer operating system and click on the download button of the one that your computer has. It could be Windows, Mac or Linux. In my case, I'll be using Windows. After clicking on your operating system download button, you will see two types of installers. You can choose either of them. After downloading the installer, you have to click on it for it to start running. If a dialog window pops up saying that the computer suggests you to not to install the app, you have to click on Download anyways, our software is safe. Then you have to click on Next in all of the dialog windows that will appear. And now we have TubeTube on our computer. Now, before we start doing our first animation exercises, let's check on the artist community of TubeTube. If you look at the TubeTube.com website, you will notice that there are a lot of animations posted by students from various countries. In this community, you will have the opportunity to share your experiences and knowledge with fellow artists. If you want, you can join and post your own exercises and comment on the ones from other artists. This is optional, but it's also completely free. Now, I'll show you how I signed up. On tubitude.com, you have to click on Login Sign Up. This button is located on the upper right corner. A small window will show up for you to sign up. You have to click on the new user tab for a register form to pop up in which you will only have to write your email. Then you have to write the same letters that are shown in the upper side and now you will receive an email with a link to the 2 p 2 website. You have to click on it to finish your sign up process. It will ask you to write your name, your artist's name or nickname and your new account password. Now your account is registered, meaning that you can log in using the login sign up button, but now clicking on the login tab. You will log in into the website using your email and password, and from that moment you will be able to comment on other artists' animation exercises and post your own ones. Okay, but how do I publish my own exercises? Don't worry, I'll explain it to you, but one step at a time. The first thing that you have to keep in mind is that in the 2 tube community you can publish both animation and illustration exercises. And to do so, you have to first start by setting up the app with the user data which is registered on the 2 tube website. It's time to open the 2 tube app for the first time in our computer. In this video, we won't be drawing in the app, but we will be doing so in following videos. Let's finish setting up the app. First, open the TubeTube software and then go to the menu in the upper side. Right there, click on the Edit option and then on the Preferences button. On the dialog window that will show up, click on Social Media and then enter the email and password that you used to sign up on the TubeTube website. Lastly, click on Apply and now you will be able to post your exercises on the TubeTube community. Great, that's all for this video. However, in the next one, we will be doing our first illustration exercise with the TubeTube software and we'll post it in our brand new account. If you want to be part of our community, subscribe on the TubeTube website. I'll be posting my own animation and illustration exercises there and I'll be waiting for your comments. New and interesting content is coming soon here in our YouTube channel and also in our Instagram and TikTok. So stay tuned!